Hi, my name's Joe, I'm the lead developer at 8 by 8 I'm going to talk to you a little bit about a game we've been working on called Frank's Stay Out. So Frank's Stay Out would be a 3D adventure game with the emphasis on exploration and discovery. The idea is that you'll be able to sail to different places in this world and meet new creatures and go on little adventures. It's not going to be so much in the way of combat, it would be more like just interaction with these uh, wonderful characters. So the, yeah, the actual art style is done by a illustrator called Billy Mather. It's got a very distinctive style and hopefully that will give the game world a quite consistent and interesting look. So at the moment we've got some simple uh, collision detection, some character controls and uh, some lighting. As you can see, when Frank's not doing anything, he has this nice little low, this little almost like he wants to do a dance. And we've got a nice transition to the walk animation. And once the player hits the run toggle button, we'll go into full running mode. So we, uh, we can pass through these trees with no difficulty here, and there's some collision set up on them. So uh, as you can see, this is quite narrow here, so he's not going to pass through though. And you can't walk through trees or anything like that, this collision's all been set up. And then here we've got some steps. Now this, the collision on the steps is actually uh, quite precise and probably a bit overkill uh, for this game. But it does mean that we get a nice smooth transition between the different steps with the character. And it's just quite nice. Hopefully we can keep that in the game and find a bit of a cheaper way of doing it. That's kind of all we got at the moment, uh, some very simple objects, simple collision, animations, lighting. Hopefully we're going to get some water physics put into the game and some other interesting bits and pieces, like moving light sources and stuff. So that's what we've got at the moment. But if you want more details about how we're making this game Unity, then check out the blog at 8 x 8net Find the link in the description.